to give you praise, Lord God. Only your name is sure we give you praise in this place, Lord.
and against, ito po, and against evil spirits in the heavenly places. So, whom we are fighting with again, sabay sabay, against evil rulers and authorities of the unseen world, against mighty powers in this dark world, and against evil spirits in the heavenly places. Let us pray. Father, indeed, you are exposing Within these last days, O oh God, we are not ignorant for the schemes from the plots, from the attacks yes. of the enemy. Yes. You are exposing this evil, dark world, O oh God, which originated in heavenly places. So I pray, Father, open our spiritual eyes, especially our spiritual understanding, that we may be able to see and perceive what you are about and you are going to do upon each and every one of us, not in physical uh, realm, O oh God, but in heavenly realms, in spiritual realms, O oh God, to those who desire to increase, O oh Lord God, knowing you in spirits. Father, I pray you are the one who will meet their deepest needs, needs this afternoon. Yung pong may mga nagnanais na makilala ka pa ng mas malalim sa espiritong kaparaanan, ikaw po ang magpapakilala at tatagpo sa bawat isa sa hapon na ito. Itago mo lamang po ang iyong lingkod sa iyong krus o Diyos at ikaw lamang po ang patuloy na maitaas at ang patuloy na makita. Sa pangalan ng Panginoong Jesus, Amen and Amen. Sige po, we will carry on. Yan, ganun po akong pinipare lang naman po. Because I believe uh, this is expository. No? Expository siya. So, we have more vision. May mga visual po tayo. Ano yung nakikita nyo before? Yan. Before, no? Ganda na, ano? That is Ukraine. No, isa po na. So, isa lang. <laughs> one by one na sa iyo. Ukraine po yan. Before the war in Ukraine, that is there plaza, kumbaga sa ano eh, parang yung sa atin, no? Plaza po siya. Ano po? Hindi ko nakuha yung uh, place ng ano, yung pangalan ng place na yan. But yung plaza mismo nila, uh, napaka, this is um, historical po sa Ukraine, itong lugar na to. I'm sorry, I didn't get the exact uh, place. Pero after the war, look what happened. Diba? Devastated. Devastated. Next, Josea. Ayan. Ito po hindi yan sa Ukraine. This is somewhere in Arab nation po. Ayan. Tingnan nyo yung palengke nila nun. No? Kita-kita po, no? And after the war again. Maganda po ba? <laughs> It is lovely to see the aftermath of this event. Next. Ayan. <laughs> Carry on na po, may nagsasabun <laughs> No? Ano po yan? Family. Maganda po ba? Nakaka-enjoy bang tingnan? Nakpamilya ay nakaaway. <laughs> Is it pleasing into your eyes? No. no. And then, isa-isa na ha, Josea? One by one. How about this? Is he happy? Serious? Serious siya, no? Seryoso talaga. He, he shows uh, that he is in a situation maybe because of Josea. Ayun. Sino nga naman ang ingiti? Pagka you are depressed, sorrow, stress, anger, failure, suffering, tired, frustration, hindi ka talaga makakamit. Even Paul's is mine. You cannot. You cannot take his mind. You cannot take joy. Makikita sa mga mukha yan. Kaya ngiti ano ang katabi mo. Yung totoong ngiti. Ngiti ng tagumpay. Amen? The smile of victory. Simula pa lang victorious na tayo. Ngiti pa lang yan. Amen? We will carry on. Because this is about army, so I just uh, research. 
Uh, the, my source is from jarganjosh.com. So this is the latest po, no? At 2013, the top 10 armies, highest number of active duty military personnel around the world is first of always po, China. They have 2,185,000 numbers of armed army ready for battle. Wag mong kantiin yan. <laughs> 2 million yan. Ang India, hinahanap ko ang Pilipinas. <laughs> Nandito tayo sa list, pero nandun tayo sa after ng mga Malaysia, ganyan. But in, kunin na lang natin yung laging top 3 uh, countries. China, 2 million. Sabihin na po natin, 2.5 2,185,000 India, marami din po sila. 1,455,000 and 550,000 armies. United States, 1,388,000 and 100 armies. Next, next pa lang pala, ang Korea, ang North Korea at ang Russia. You see? No? Akala natin, sila, no, Russia, ang maraming armies. China is still the, the, the first. Doble po ang armies ng China. Let us carry on. Kasi po, this is physical armies. Amen? Balikan natin muna, Josh. This is physical armies. We have data. Kasi when we present of something, we need to back up by data of evidence. So this is physical. Hindi naman po siguro ito idadayain no, ng, ng, uh, ng source na kinunang ko. This is also based on the National Statistics Office. So, valid ang data na to. This data is validated from National Statistics Office. Sa so, mga nagre-research, pwede nyo siyang gamitin as long i-quote nyo lang kung kanino nyo siyang source kinuha. Amen? But we are now going up. Papunta na po tayo sa ating main topic. So, Legion. When we say legion, we can, this is, um, this legion, I've learned that they use this word, terminology, during the Roman empires. Hindi po nila ginagamit ang batalyon or crowd or multitude that time. Pag sinabi nilang susuburin ka namin ang aming legion, I will, I'm, I'm coming with my legion of armies. Yun, legion of army. Ito po yung ginagamit the Roman empires. I were using this terminology. But and the synonyms is battalion. We are now using battalion, multitude, or crowd. So 3,000 to 6,000 men. So pag sinabi nila, susugod kami sa iyo. I have five legions with me. So how many? Let's get the 6,000 times five. 30,000. <laughs> Ang dami. 30,000 of armies. No? Siguro talaga noon ang laban ng legions. Eh. Legions. At talagang bakbakan. Legion by legion. So ang example nito, dito, no? examples, physical. Sa physical muna tayo. Again, back up by data. When this stadium has 90,000 seats, search nyo yan. Kahit search nyo po siya. 90,000 seats. Ang kaya i-occupy ng Wembley Stadium. And sa, sa spiritual naman po, in Mark 5, verse 1 and 13, the man who was possessed by a multitude of demons who give the collective name of legion. So mababasa, we can read this legion in the Bible. Isang tao, ilan ang legion again? Let's get the 6,000. He was possessed by 6,000 demons. Demons. Pag bisaya, demons. Pag demon yung mga tabi ganito. Demons. 6,000 demons. Isang tao, hindi na ulit yung katabi mo. It, he is free indeed. Amen? Wala na po tayo yan. Huwag kang magbibit ng 6,000. One is enough. Amen? We are carrying the Spirit of God. Amen? Amen. Sige po, give him the glory as I have said. As God told me, what kind of teaching is this, Lord, expository? We are exposing the enemy's tactics. 
Amen? In, in physical and in spiritual. So, 90,000, nagkaroon ako ng konting numbers po dito. Now, Raja, 90,000 divided by 6,000 is equals to 90,000 divided by 6,000. How many people? Ayan ang Wembley. Tingnan nyo, no, 90,000 po ang kaya niyang i-occupy. Amen? So, sa 90,000 na yan, divided by 6,000, isang tao na may 6,000 na demonyo. Ilang tao? How many person, people? Kaya nyo? 15! 15! <laughs> Ganun siya kalaki? Only 15 people can occupy this? If we see this in our spiritual eyes, the Wembley Stadium can only occupy by 15 people na may bitbit na anim na libo. Talaga palang greedy ang ano, no? <laughs> the spirit is greedy. Nakita nyo? Kung baga kinukuha niya lahat. <laughs> Gusto niya kang kinin lahat. Pati yung ganito po kalaki. If we see, open our spiritual eyes so we can see what God is speaking right now. This stadium is 90,000 capacity. But as we have said a while ago, 6,000 can possess, uh, 6,000 demons can possess a uh, one person. Ganon siya katindi. Kaya akala mo, no? Mm -hmm, demonyo lang yan. Kaya pag mo mong tatawagin ng asawa mo ng demonyo ka, <laughs> you are invited. Ay, 6,000. Huwag mo siyang tatawagin. Tawagin mo siya ng Han. Mahal. Amen? Ano pa ka sa mga tukpan kasi ngayon si asawa? <laughs> Huwag mo siyang tatawa. Sabi naman nung lalaki, nung lalaki, demonya ka. <laughs> Sabi naman sa mga anak, mga demonyito kayo. Kaya pala ang gulo-gulo ng tahanan. That's why the family, the house, is full of problems, no? Because when we speak these words, we are inviting the spirits. It is opening the 